What's up YouTube? It's Austin here and today I'm going to be talking to you about some interesting technology that I'm going to be using on my 2021 YFZ450R build. Now sitting in front of me today is a JE 13.5 to 1 piston and wrist pin which I received through Woods Racing for the upcoming Quad Cross Northwest series. However, you'll notice something different about the appearance of these parts and that's because they've been WPC treated. So what the hell exactly is WPC treatment? Well, according to their website, it's a micro shot peening process which strengthens the part and greatly reduces friction. The end result in this case is a piston that is more durable, more reliable, and has a more free feeling engine characteristic. So let's go ahead and dive into how that works and what exactly all this means. But first, if you enjoy my content here on YouTube, please consider joining my Patreon in the description down below. It's completely voluntary, but it's a huge help in allowing me to continue putting out great content for this channel. At the very least, if you can, go ahead and like, subscribe, and leave a comment down below. Now, let's get back to the cool stuff. There are a few key benefits to WPC, and the first is a reduction in friction. When you take away that friction, you're also reducing the wear on the parts and the buildup of heat. This is especially important in areas like the side skirts of the piston and here on the wrist pin. See, the piston only travels in a straight line but the rod is rotating on the crank. The end result is that you have additional wear on the side skirts due to the forward and back force of the rotation of the rod, as well as the wrist pin, which connects the rod to the piston and requires a bit of rotation to make everything work properly. All of these surfaces are direct metal to metal and WPC helps ensure minimal wear or friction occurs in these areas. That not only helps with longevity and durability, but it has a secondary benefit of making sure that there's less drag on the motor and less power lost. To explain this best, you don't actually gain power from making a modification like this, but what you do accomplish is you create more direct power because the engine doesn't have to work as hard to produce its power output. This is what some people might describe as kind of a free feeling motor. Now as an amateur racer, that means slow. I can't say that I'm necessarily gonna actually feel this benefit, but I do appreciate that my motor is gonna last longer and hold up better due to the reliability benefits of making this modification. The WPC treatment not only provides the benefits that I've already mentioned, but it also helps ensure that this piston is less prone to cracking or deforming in the case that things go boom boom. Now you may be asking yourself, what is the cost of such an incredible technology and the answer to that is $51 before shipping. Oh, and uh, it only took like a week and a half from the time that I contacted them until the time that I got it back here in my hands. You simply just go to WPC's website, link in the description, and fill out a form to get started. And you can do this to valves, cams, pretty much anything you can think of. Let your imagination run wild, I guess. but. I had a brand new piston sitting in front of me, so I figured I'd start with this. And that's really all there is to it. WPC has some pretty neat videos on their YouTube page where you can check out the nitty gritty details of the actual process of micro shot peening, and you can also see what friction nistless looks like in action. But uh, as for me, that's really pretty much all I have to explain for you today. And last but not least, make sure you stay tuned here on the channel. If you didn't already, please subscribe. Maybe uh, hit that alert notification while you're at it because uh, if I'm going to be doing a top end, you can imagine there's going to be a lot more in-depth videos coming soon, so stay tuned for those.